I'm Jennifer Angel from Mistress of Astrology and these are your stars for the coming week, Virgo. Now there's a lot of activity around Mercury which is your ruling planet, Virgo, and it's in the solar third house so it's in an area of communication and Mercury governs communication and communication on any level, whether it be um, technological or you know, texting or emailing or just having a old-fashioned discussion, okay? And that's very much on the cards this week because uh, not only just being in your solid third house, there's actually um, all to do with communication and media. It's also a creative area of your chart. It uh, does bring in siblings as well, uh, which is a uh, noteworthy thing. This is the week of Thanksgiving, if you happen to be in the US of A. Um, and there's three aspects this week to do with Mercury. There's a conjunction with uh, Saturn, sextile Venus, and also a trine with uh, Jupiter. So let's go through and see what that actually means to you in a bit more plain talk. Um, all right, so uh, it's it's very much around your personal life, um, friends, and uh, also just family oriented. So um, children. So it's very much even if you're not in America and celebrating Thanksgiving, then it's certainly. Uh, a week where you can be thankful for the people that you have around you and the people that, that love and support you. It's, it's a very much that type of, of vibration. Um, and certainly with the Jupiter sitting in your 11th house, it's a time where if you can find a way to give back, then it's almost like what you do to help other people comes back to you and it certainly builds good karma. So um, if you can have discussions, maybe even on a community level, to try and reach out and help someone else, um, then as I said, that, that can and does build good karma in your life. Now, um, with the Venus sitting in your solar fifth house, this is an area where love affairs can start, Virgo. So if you're looking for love, then you know get out and about. And of course, to find someone who you have an intellectual connection with is very important. Um, <clears throat> and certainly with all this activity to do with with Mercury and around communication, then that's going to be uh, pretty easy for you to start up a communication with someone that you feel you have a connection with. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. So the main thing, I, I guess, for you, Virgo, is you want to speak from the heart, okay? And whatever you do this week, particularly with Mars in your sign, because Mars gives you the, the will to make your life happen the way that you want it to happen, then you want to make sure that you speak from the heart. And remember, it's the intention always that is important. Okay, have a great week, Virgo. I'm Jen